Hey folks, hey, I just want to jump in here before this video gets started and just let you know that uh, I have gotten a new phone and along with the new phone came a new case. Uh, unfortunately, what I didn't realize is that the microphone is covered and so in this video, uh, the audio is not great. Uh, it is the best that I, it is what it is. So rest assured that the problem will get fixed uh, in the upcoming videos. So, well, I gotta go back to editing, so enjoy this video. Boy, that is an absolutely beautiful sunrise. Right between those clouds that the boys are playing out here, getting ready to feed the piggies. Pigs know it too. Pigs are so fun, man. They're, they're just, they're so, so funny. And having two of these guys, oh man, this has been fantastic. All right, well, I better feed these guys before they break through their pen. So we are expecting some pretty big snow today. But, uh, yeah, I don't know how much we're going to get. Uh, the reports are anywhere between, like, three to six inches. The problem is, is it's the uh, very heavy, wet snow, uh, which is uh, most common, you know, here in March. So... We're just going to have to play it by ear. Uh, the good news is it's not supposed to come, uh, or at least it's not supposed to start uh, until later this afternoon. So we are going to be working in the cabin today uh, as I did get some of those uh, fence panels uh, pulled out of the snow. Uh, I've got another one about three quarters of the way, but I'm going to be able to use some of them panels to get those out of there. Uh, yeah, we're going to start working on uh, wrapping up the... Uh, the windows, we've got three more to put the uh, put panels on, uh, trim and so forth. And then depending on how much we have left, uh, we will probably uh, start working on floorboards and then the ceiling trim as well. Try and wrap that up uh, and at least get one of these cabins done with the uh, trim. So yeah, right now I'm gonna I already fed the piggies, so I gotta go feed the boys. Uh, Jen is getting herself up and awake. And so, yeah, let's go feed these dogs and then uh, let's get after these windows. All right, so unbeknownst to me when I started this little project, uh, we've got a few, oops, we have a few nails that we have to deal with. So right here, uh, these nails are protruding from the outdoor uh, siding. I've got them here on the, the bottom plate. And I also have them here on the top. 
So, we got our rotary tool. We'll make quick work of these, get these out of there so that we have the room to fit the uh, plates in. And the, uh, yeah. And unfortunately, with the warmer temperatures come these buggers. Yeah. Not happy about that, but that's life in the woods. So uh, we're gonna have to uh, get our sticky tape, get those on the windows because as the temperatures continue to rise, these cluster flies are gonna continue to come out of the woodwork and try to get outside uh, and into the woods. But unfortunately for them, the ones that got caught here uh, in the fall are doomed to die in a cabin. <laughs> Uh, it is a morbid thought, but it is what it is. So let's get to cutting these nails off. Taking a quick break to have some uh, wonderful breakfast. Yes, Jen made fresh baby again. So we're gonna eat this and then we'll get back on the uh, windows. Okay, so this is done. Well, we've gotten all of the trim in except for this top piece, which uh, was 48 inches long. And unfortunately that piece was actually still stuck in ice. So. I got it free and now it is over by the wood stove drying out. Uh, while that is drying, we're going to go ahead and pull the entertainment center out away from this window and we're going to work on this one next. Which brings me <laughs> to the topic of our uh, uh, entertainment center. So we got a new one. We had a table here and we were using it as kind of a collect all for tools and so forth. But uh, we went ahead and got ourselves a nice little entertainment center. Uh, it's kind of cool. You know, we, uh, we, these are the barn, barn door style doors, which is really neat. Uh, the reason we went with the barn uh, door style is because eventually the bathroom door and the bedroom door, once I build the wall, will have barn doors. So we wanted to kind of uh, kind of roll everything together, uh, little barn door styles here in the living room, and then barn doors, you know, in the back cabin. So, anyways, uh, I gotta get this pulled out and then start working on that window. Well, despite seeing the sun right there, Reality is, is south of us, which is in that direction, you're gonna get hit with a massive nor'easter. Now, as of right now, the coast is expected to get hit with like 12 to 18 inches. At least that's what we're hearing. Uh, we're gonna get hit with about three to six, but honestly, with these nor'easters, I mean, it's hard to tell the weather apps that we use are constantly changing and, and being modified. The reality though is that we are gonna get hit with some, some snow uh, later today and tonight. It is gonna be that heavy, wet, nasty stuff, uh, which means we are gonna have to be watching this all night. And then I don't know if you can see it from here, but also that garage uh, right there, both soft walls. Now the good news for Jen and I is that this will be the last winter that we have these soft wall canopies up. It is something we have to deal with still today uh, and more importantly tonight through the storm, which means her and I will be getting up every couple hours or so. Uh, the heavy wet snow really tends to put a lot of weight and a lot of stress on these things. And we don't wanna have a repeat of what we had last year where uh, one of these sides of that canopy actually collapsed on us. So. All right, well, I went ahead and I got some more boards dug out. So I've got to pull these nails and uh, let some of these dry. Now I am gonna bring these into the cabin, put these up next to the wood heat, uh, let them dry. So maybe this afternoon 
you know, these will all dry up enough for me, but uh, yeah, we'll see. Okay, folks, so we are all done now. Um, the windows are all done. We've trimmed them all out. They've got all of their stuff in there. They look amazing. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't do a lot of video because with the sun and working on the windows, it just doesn't come out very well. So uh, I'll just show you what it looks like, but I'm just glad that we're done with them. Now I do have one window left that's in the kitchen, but before I can put any of the trim in there, I have to put the backsplash. And the backsplash right now is buried in snow. So as soon as I can get it out there and I've got the time, then we're gonna get that window finished. But for, for now, our windows are done and we can move on to the next part, which is our trim. So hey, thanks for watching. Uh, if you haven't done so, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you on the next video where we're gonna put on all of our trim.